Hi, right, yo, what's up guys? Be back, be thrifty again. Um, <coughs> yeah, I mean, I've sort of been slacking. Like, I'm out of school now for the year, or till February next year, pretty much. So, if you're not from New Zealand, you won't really understand, but I finished in like this, like November, December. It's like a three month break, and then start in January, late January, early February. Anyway, yeah, we are thrifting again. I've been slacking, so sorry about that. I'm gonna try. No, get as many um, trip, thrift stuff as I can. Christmas coming up and everything. Gotta buy Christmas presents. I got a lot of, I got a lot to do coming up to Christmas, but um, yeah, I'll try. So we are approaching the first thrift. Um, and yeah. Jesus fucking ugh. Um, yeah, so I'll pick it up when I get to the first thrift. Peace. A good amount today. Well, yeah, not not really compared to last thing. It's the stack and then this thing, which I'll get into. But yeah, a good amount um, came up on a grail. But um, first off, got this Boston. Ooh, ah oh, shit! What is it called? Boston something. Um. Cap, I read somewhere that like hats with like a green um, thing underneath the brim, like fold or something. I don't know. Correct me in the comments, but 
yeah, this was a dollar. And so I got this Akos Polo. I actually don't know if this is real, but this was also a dollar, so something goes wrong. I made this look really weird. It's a tag. Yeah, that was a dollar. And then I got these um, Adidas, Adidas shorts. Like three stripes down the side. I think I might keep these size large. I got these for $7, New Zealand dollars as well. All the prices that I show are New Zealand dollars. So for you Americans, don't get freaking insane. I get ripped off. Well, I sort of agree, but <laughs> um, next up, I got these um, these Kappa board shorts. Um, these were also a dollar. Um, yeah, these are a size medium. Doesn't really look like it. I might try these on, but um, yeah, also a dollar. Then the biggest come up on this trip to the thrift. I got this jacket. Now, all right, I got this for like twenty six dollars. Okay. So this is this was from a boutique store. Um yep. So it was ninety-two dollars, right? Then it was half off, so that made it forty six. And then I had twenty dollars store credit, because when you spend for over four hundred dollars at that store, you get twenty dollars store credit. So I use that store credit to bring it down to twenty six. So I'm keeping this shit. Unless I get a very good offer I can't refuse, I'm keeping it. I've been looking for one of these for a steal for ages. And it's mine. I'm wearing it this winter. This is like fucking three million years ago. But yes, that was the biggest come up. Now I've got one more thing. Um, I'm gonna get on my knees for this. Um, I got this. Three bucks. Now apparently, this is from 2006. I just saw. Um, apparently these are very rare. Um, yeah, that's cool. But yeah, it's an Assassin's Creed game. Now, I looked up eBay comps, one sold for 100 New Zealand dollars. That one was sealed though. This one, the tin isn't sealed, but if I open this up, how do I open it? There it is, there we go. The game is sealed, which is very good. Um, yes, the game is sealed. Now, apparently, yeah, like I said, apparently these go for over $100. But that one was sealed, so I won't sell it for, well, I wasn't going to sell it for 100 anyway, but yeah, I'm going to look around. Um, but they also come with this, which is like a sort of like a comic book sort of thing. That's pretty cool. Um, and it also comes with a certificate of authenticity. So, you know, you know, it's not that fake shit. Um, yeah. So I'm going to look, look into how much these are worth. Like I said, there's a completed eBay listing for over 100 New Zealand dollars. But that one was sealed. Like, the tin was sealed, everything. And apparently that makes a big difference. So, yes, if you're a game collector and are interested, hit me up. Or if you have any information, hit me up. Um, I might take it to EB Games because there's a few game collectors there that are like right into it, so they might give me a good offer. Or they'll just fucking offer me two dollars like the rest of the games I sell to them. But um yeah, that's about it. Um that was it for today. Oh uh, yes, also I recently bought this Tommy Hilfiger wallet. And yeah, I I sort of overpaid for it. I paid forty six dollars for it. Um Yeah, that's about it. This is my chair by the way. Um, anything else? No, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that shit. Uh, follow me on Instagram at NZ Vintage with two E's. So N Z V I N T A G E E. And then my personal is whatever underscore underscore Daniel, two underscores. So spell i'm not gonna bother spelling it but um yeah it should be in the description so yeah thank you guys for watching um peace uh.